After back-to-back -back early exits in the six-man playoffs, the Big Sandy Pioneers have been preaching unfinished business all year long. Well, they get to take a step toward completing that business with a first-round matchup against the Weibo Longhorns. It is a Big Sandy game, so you know you're going to get a heavy dose of Cade Struts. Here's the first quarter from 29 yards out. The senior running back breaks not one, not two, not three, but four arm tackles on the way to a score. Six-nothing. Pioneers. Cade's brother Cody, pretty good at football as well. Slings it downfield to Braden Klein. That'll be a 27-yard touchdown. 12-nothing Pioneers. Just before half, Big Sandy deep in their own territory. So what do you do? You give it to Cade Struts again. He'll find the left sideline and he won't go down. 75 yards to the house. 32-0 at the break. Weebo finally breaks through in the third. Colton Miske to Jonathan Harris. He breaks loose for a touchdown. Longhorns on the board. But Big Sandy had an answer, and his name is Cade Strutz. He's in for his sixth touchdown of the day from 15 yards out, and the Pioneers dominate 57-6. They'll advance to the next round of the six-man playoff. Yeah, you know, I, I, I told the kids, you know, Weebo, they got a whole trophy case full of football trophies up there and uh, and they were gonna come and play football whether uh, they, they were they were coming to play ball and uh, so I, I told them before the game get after it uh, make sure we just come out hard and and uh, do what we just just play big sandy football do what we do yeah it was a it was a great win really really happy for the team everyone played great uh, we had some kids step up huge for us and that's awesome it's in big sandy Tom Wiley MTN sports